Hey guys, it's Katie Kate on the Homestead. Today is pantry restock day. So before I put all this stuff away, I thought I would show you what $275 is buying right now up here in Canada. I know inflation is really high right now, but honestly, I'm finding that shopping smart and shopping the flyers and the sales is proving to not be really outrageously expensive right now. Okay, so what does $275 Canadian look like in food at the moment? I think I picked up 80 items and I did need a few things for the house, which contributed to the cost this run. Okay, for the pantry snack cupboard, we've got treats, cookies, chips. I've got a pantry size box of microwavable popcorn. My son uh, likes that a lot. Some ketchup. For the pantry, evaporated milk, corn, three jars of salsa, uh, four jars of instant coffee that was on sale, a couple of boxes of cookies, sugar, um, canned fruit for the pantry, so mandarin and pineapple, couple loaves of plain white bread, four packs of hot dog buns. These will go in the freezer Six boxes of KD, again, a really simple snack. These are a bulk item. These cookies are also a bulk item. A couple bottles of soda. These are a few things I needed for the house. So some rope, some calamine lotion, and some needle nose pliers. They actually forgot the six inch set of pliers. So I'm gonna have to follow up with that. Fresh items, we got some vegetables, strawberries, a couple of bags of oranges. These were on sale, cream cheese, sour cream. Those are for me, high calorie things that I like. Um, hummus, bulk item, lettuce, bananas. And I got six packs of these. They were $5 off and these will go in the freezer. Again, a really great thing for my son and then uh, three bags of milk. I also picked up uh, an extra bag of cat food, a box of cat litter, and an electric kettle because mine died. That's really not a bad grocery haul for $275. So not a bad haul for the cost, you know, we have lots of snacks for the weekend and then for the next week or so. I have extra pantry items to replace things. Um, there's also some tuna back there that I forgot to point out. There's a couple cans of tuna back there. Right there. Enough bread for a couple of weeks. We basically have enough fresh food for a couple of weeks. And then my pantry restocks. So... Again, I know that inflation is high here and things are expensive, but I am finding shopping the flyer and focusing on things that are on sale when I do this every two weeks is actually proving to be really effective. There actually wasn't a lot of meat on sale, so I didn't buy much other than the hot dog wieners that I got. Uh, but I do have a good supply of beef from my neighbor across the street. I am out of pork uh, ribs, but I will wait until I find those on sale. Okay, so there's my pantry restock update. I'm gonna get busy and get all this stuff in the cupboard, um, stocked up for at least another couple weeks. So um, until next time, happy healthy living investing in sustainability here on the homestead. I'm Katie Kate and I'll see you later.